kill the uh, tunes there. I don't know, by the way, if I'm going to start uh, every video with me dancing to music or playing air guitar like I did in my recent Minecraft Episode Zero, but it's a strong, strong possibility. Welcome back, geeks. I am Unite the Clans, back in your life uh, with another, or the very first episode of Drinking by Myself. That is my vlog. For those of you uh, expecting mostly video game stuff, uh, it will be. That is what my channel will be. Uh, and this vlog uh, is actually going to uh, account, uh, recount my experiences uh, trying to start my own YouTube channel. Uh, it is a dream I've had for a long time, and I made it a goal in the new year. Right around Christmas, I thought, I've been thinking about this for such a long time, I should just freaking do it. Uh, so when the new year started, I took the money that I was going to spend on a tropical vacation to the Mayan Riviera in Mexico. I took that money, and I spent it on a computer. That one right there. Um, spent it on that computer, uh, and that lets me play the best games, uh, record uh, my gameplay, and then edit and render using, you know, top-notch software. Uh, the computer uh, is my ticket to who knows what, uh, and uh, that's the thing. Starting a YouTube channel these days is not the happy accident it used to be. Where you can blink, and next thing you know, you got a hundred thousand subscribers, and you did it by accident, and then you're quitting your job, and you're on your way to a million. The cat's kind of out of the bag. I think anybody who is in my position, if you are, and you've been thinking about it, or you've already started your channel, um, you're doing it with the very real possibility uh, in the back of your mind that if you do this right, fingers crossed, you can make a little beer money. Uh, and then, who knows, beyond that, you could, you could turn that into your job. Uh, it's something that I think everybody who is starting a channel considers. Uh, it would be great if your YouTubers were all just posting videos out of the kindness of their hearts, but most people who start now are starting with the serious intention of at least making it a part-time job. Uh, and that's kind of the case uh, for me, and I think... I was surprised at how much there was to learn, uh, and like I said, I could have been making these vlogs for the last nine weeks, but uh, then my channel would be mostly vlogs, and when I actually got to playing uh, video games like was the plan, uh, people might be a little caught off guard after just pure vlogging. Uh, so these will probably come out uh, if, you know, if I can keep up with it. Uh, once a week. I can't make any guarantees right now because it's also new and there's so much to learn. Uh, but they should be fairly easy to record. I'm kind of recording this one on a whim. Uh, I've got a reason to. I have just finished um, with all the principal recording for uh, my very first uh, Let's Play. It's episode zero of my, my Minecraft Let's Play. Um, and if you haven't checked that out, please do. It's going to be fun. Uh, so I show off five of the best seeds that Minecraft 1.8.3 has to offer uh, and I uh, put, put a throw poll in my description on my Google Plus page uh, in the video, just link to it from the video description and um, you guys can go on there and uh, vote and fi decide where I play so a little bit interactive which is crazy, I know I have no, no subscribers, and no views when I'm recording this or that so I don't know how I expect user interaction to be a giant part of my channel, but who knows, we'll see. It's bold. I will give you that. I will give myself that. I am bold. Uh, so let's get to the point of this, guys. This is going to be a vlog uh, about my experience. And the first thing that came to mind is that my nights now, inst instead of being spent, you know, as often working in the busy restaurant and bar that I work in, um, or hanging out with friends are spent at that computer either trying to figure out how I'm going to record learning something I need to do or now recording, I'm actually doing it now um, and accompanying that has been a lot of just booze I'm going through a lot of it because I'm here alone 
uh, and as the night goes on, I will like to crack a beer or a bottle of wine, uh, or in this case, to celebrate uh, the uh, last, or the first recording I've ever really done. It still needs to be edited and, and whatever, but to celebrate having finished that, uh, I'm going to crack some bubbly. Uh, in this episode, this, this vlog is called drinking by myself for one very good reason. It's because I, I tend to do a lot of it now, and in every episode I will also just drink by myself, but with you guys. Uh, so it'll be, be kind of a group thing. Feel free to crack a beer uh, if that's your thing, and you're old enough. So uh, that's, that's it. This is drinking by myself. This is episode zero, uh, and kind of episode one. I'm going to introduce, I've already introduced you to the idea of the vlog like I did in episode zero of my Minecraft series, but I think I'm also going to talk about an experience I've had recently. So let's get, uh, while I do it, to the bubbly. It is a bottle of a very cheap cava. Show off my waitering skills here. Frijane. Uh, got a glass. Actually, you guys don't need to see me open that. You should see me talk while I open it. Uh, I have found uh, that it is so easy to get distracted. Uh, this is my first video, and it was my New Year's resolution, and February is almost over. You know, I had to build a new computer, so fair enough, that took some time. Um, but, you know, everything else I didn't really have to do. Uh, I found a great artist uh, to do some art for my channel, and Dog's making a lot of noise. He's kind of doesn't know what I'm doing over here. Freaking him out. He's smart. I'm talking to just no one, and that's freaking him out. Which smart? That should happen to a dog. Um, so there's your bottom now. Uh, so uh, it's super easy to get distracted. Uh, I, you know, would it be nice if instead of recording this on my iPhone, I was recording this on. This, the camera I bought specifically for the purpose, yeah, that'd be awesome. But this is not working uh, right now. Would it be great if I had a professional lighting kit instead of just some IKEA lamps? Is that come into focus? Yeah. Uh, of course, that would be awesome. And you know what? I have almost spent money on that. Uh, and you know what? When you see the video quality with IKEA lights and you know, iPhone recording it, it might, might, might be worth it for me to get that camera fixed and get a couple of professional soft boxes in a backdrop, some overhead lighting. You know, it's a real possibility down the road. It might be something that we can do. Um, but I don't need that. Of course I can start recording with just my phone. Uh, I don't have my video card yet for my rig, which is this beautiful glowing blue uh, computer elegant fractal R5 designs case uh, of, you know, I don't have a video card. I can let that stop me. I can play Minecraft without a video card. There's a ton of games I can play and record without a video card uh, without, you know, the graphics get, being too bad. Uh, so I'm going to turn your eyes back to the bottle of champagne once again. Uh, but as a waiter, I'm supposed to keep that as quiet as possible. I know it's a video. Uh, that never happens. That only happens in like movies and TVs. I guess I shook this up a little bit. So, uh, yeah, I know it would have been great to do a big loud cork pop when I hit the ceiling for the video, but I'm a professional. And, uh, I only know one way of opening it. That's the right way. So here we go, guys. Frijone for me uh, to celebrate. Uh, now I'm celebrating because I didn't get distracted today. I spent all day yesterday being distracted and getting nothing done with one of my days off. Uh, and then I get kind of reminded of something I heard recently. I was listening to uh, the Joe Rogan Experience podcast. It's an old episode, but I just listened to it. Uh, it's with Cameron Haynes, who is a bow hunter. And he was talking about uh, a saying of his. And... You know, it's pretty simple. It's just, nobody cares. Work harder. 
and he was curious if that was, you know, actually negative. It's not. It's so positive. It kind of kicked me in the butt and got me back to what I needed to be doing. Uh, so check out Cam Haynes and the Joe Rogan podcast. So good. Uh, but, you know, I just started thinking about that. I'm like, nobody cares. Oh, you're feeling sick. That's why you didn't put out a video. And then you don't have a video. Nobody cares. Just put in the work. You have to do it. Uh, nothing worth having, and this is an old one, it comes easy. You have to work hard for everything, uh, everything that, uh, that you really want. It's going to be hard to drink in a vlog and keep talking. Uh, but it's really easy to get unmotivated. It doesn't take much, as, as you can tell by that one, that one thing, you know, to get your ass in gear, get you re-motivated. Um, and at the end of it, you can reward yourself with a glass of bubbly, with a hot bath, with a movie night, you know, with uh, dinner with your significant other, something that you would have otherwise put off if you hadn't managed to get everything done in the time that you had available. Today I did, I got it done. It took me longer than I thought. Uh, it's dark now, uh, but uh, it, it's done. I still gotta edit it, but that's tomorrow's challenge is getting yourself motivated to, to do it. Um, but, you know, the reward is so much more worth it. If I did nothing today, and then I cracked a bottle of, of uh, bubbly, it wouldn't taste very good. Uh, it doesn't taste that good. It's super cheap. But it tastes pretty good right now. Because uh, I'm, I'm happy with myself. So... Guys, uh, thank you for tuning in to the very first episode of Drinking By Myself. Hopefully you will join me next time I drink by myself, probably in about a week. Uh, but for now, guys, I am Unite the Clans. I will see you geeks next time. And stay tuned for the next episode.